wandering a wandering mind to me is a lot like daydreaming you in life a lot of times don't get to where you're going by going in a straight line you meander a lot and it explores not only creative writing but also this concept of imagining the future building simulations of what you might experience if we were to get off this planet and explore other earth-like planets or other um, conditions that might be very extreme in environments that might not be conducive to life like just space in general um, the vacuum of it um, the idea started with not only an idea on idea pod drift which deals with exploding head syndrome but also some conversations that i had with idea pod members about dreams one in particular about um, how some people think that they never dream just be because they don't remember them so we all wake up and sometimes we feel like we've had a dreamless sleep well, the concept of a wandering mind starts with this punch through space. So when we have these episodes that are not explained by anything, it didn't, it doesn't hurt this exploding head syndrome, but this, it's just this explosive lightning flash in your head that wakes you up. And also the idea of dreamless sleep, but you wonder, where did I go? What was I dreaming? And so maybe, you not just you didn't just travel inside your head but maybe you traveled a little bit farther and you just don't remember a wandering mind brings you not only with an exploration of this inner space that we have in dreams and and mind wandering and and daydreaming and consciousness uh, when are we awake when are we asleep or when are we dreaming but also the writing process how we tie things together and pull them in and I've I've pulled in um, my creative writing as simulations that are my internet team members get together in dream space and simulate in our own ways nightmares and also um, ideal um, home, uh, home bases, where uh, we can stabilize ourselves after these extreme uh, training exercises that we do. So love at first and also nightmares at first um, are woven into a wandering mind in that way. But I've also rolled in some things, for example, with Seam Ripper, there is a love at first story called um, Devastation. And that came directly from a dream, a very detailed dream that I had. And I pulled it into a story um, and pretty much re-walked it in a, in a creative writing piece that I did.